Hello, there is already a lesson on the channel about using profiles based on lots for editing JPEG files in Lightroom. So what about Capture One? I have such a series of photos. They were shot in JPEG on Fujifilm X-T2. In this video, I will show you how to create profiles based on lots for editing JPEG files in Capture One. These photos were shot in JPEG in sRGB color space, so it is not necessary to export them from Capture One as I did with RAW files. You can just load the originals into 3D LUT Creator and grade them. I'm going to make two edits. In the first one, I will create a color harmony using color grid in LAB color model. I will also darken green and cold shades. I will move light and slider to the left to prevent warm shades from brightening. Done. I'm going to export this LUT to a folder where Capture One stores user profiles. All mentioned paths for Windows and Mac you can find in the video description. I will write JPEG in the profile's name because my raw profiles are also stored in this folder. I choose ICC file format. It's time to set up a basic profile. But which profile to choose for JPEG? The basic profile is located here. It is called No Color Correction. Done. Now I'm going to do the edit that reduces color variability of warm and cold shades. Again, there is a separate lesson on the channel dedicated to this topic. I'll leave a link in the comments below the video. This edit combines two LUTs with different color temperatures and reduces the number of shades for warm and cold colors. The transition between LUTs can be configured using a mask based on image warmth. For example, like this. I will save this LUT in the folder with user profiles. I will name it JPEG var minus. The basic profile I already selected here. I will restart Capture One while my second profile is saving. Capture One has started. In the Profiles drop-down list, I will select Show All, and then in the category Others, I will find my profiles. Here is the first LAB profile. Here is the second VAR- profile. Let's see how these profiles work with my photos. Now, let's see how the second profile works. It increases image saturation a little, but you can fix it in Capture One. Here is a photo before, here is after. That's all. Now you know how to grade photos in JPEG using LUTs in Capture One. This will greatly expand the possibilities for color correction of this editor, because Capture One doesn't have tools for working in LAB color space. There is no way to combine different white balances, but you can get much more in 3D LUT Creator. If something is not clear, please write me in the comments. Bye everyone.